Today is a first alert weather alert day because of this storm system that you see right here working its way east. Uh, and uh, that cold front continuing to trail through Southern California already beginning to clear our skies, taking that wet weather with it. We are still seeing some clouds lingering around and just a few extra showers up in those higher elevations and through the San Gorgonio Pass. Overall, we're going to watch everything here fizzle out through the rest of this evening. So the light rain it arrived this afternoon, brought a little bit of accumulation, but certainly a lot more to our west. Beaumont seeing more than an inch of rain. Cabazon just shy of seven tenths of an inch. And then down here in the desert, downtown Palm Springs picking up just over a tenth of an inch of rain. Hey, it's a little bit out of time. Could we use more? Absolutely. But runoff is certainly a big contributing factor to road closures here in the desert. So even though we don't see a lot of rain specifically, the runoff from those higher elevations still accumulates down here on the valley floor, leading to well more of a significant impact. Our mountains remain under a winter weather advisory until 6 p.m. So a little bit of snow up there, but this really wasn't a big snow event, at least for Riverside County mountains. Something we are certainly noticing seen a lot more of is the wind. So there's still a high wind warning and a wind advisory in place for the higher elevations for San Gregonio Mountain up through the high desert. That's going to expire this evening, but the wind advisory in place for the Coachella Valley will stay in place through midnight. So even as more of this rain continues to clear Southern California, we're still going to be left with some gusty conditions out there. So already we're seeing less and less rain on the radar. Again, that wind advisory remains in effect, so those gusty west winds will be continuing as we head through this evening. Something to keep in mind if you do have any outdoor plans. But moving into our Wednesday, we're going to see a little bit more sunshine. Our winds are going to be calming down, and we are going into this drying trend. And I can say that specifically for Southern California because there is more rain, more snow moving into Northern and Central California beginning tomorrow. It is just this active weather pattern that is going to be remaining consistent. So we catch a break down here through the rest of this work week, but then moving into this weekend, our first alert comfort air seven day forecast, John Karen, we have another opportunity to talk about more rain right here back in the desert.